Several we've had recently just like that, uh, but that's called baseball. We're going to win those kind of games in return at some point. Uh, yeah, of course, we're banged up a little bit. Everybody is, though, but we are. Uh, however, the our relief pitchers that really are the guys. I mean, like Looper had a tough night, and so did Iggy again. And, and listen, they're going to they're going to stop having tough nights. These guys are really that good. It's the ebb and flow of the season. I've been on a team that went to the World Series that lost seven games right before the All-Star break, and then there was a four-day break. So you sat on an 11-game losing streak mentally and then before you got back into the action. It really tests your resolve, and it, uh, and, it, and it tests really who you are because when it goes badly, that's when we need each other more. It's easy to look good when things are going well. I like the guys that look good when things are going poorly. So anyway, I'm, I'm all about our guys. I love these guys, and they're that good. They have that kind of resolve. This group does. Yeah, yeah, they, they, we support one another really well. You, you get your round enough to see that, but our group collectively, uh, it's a very interesting and, and, and again, a tightly knit group uh, right down to the new squid shirts. I don't know if you've seen those yet. I mean, there's the lesser guys. I mean, they support one another constantly, and I'll take it. You mentioned the guys that are banged up. Obviously, Shohei got the night off last night. We saw him late in the game. How's the back feeling? And is this something you guys want to monitor? Maybe give him a few more days sprinkled in here and there. It's just like I said before, it's my conversation with him. If he needs a day, he'll get it. If he tells me he's fine, he's fine. Um, I really like to listen to my veteran players. Um, there's times you want to intervene. Sometimes it's just obvious. I need to intervene. But it's some, a lot of times uh, you might be reading it wrong, so you need to talk to the source. Now, younger players, different. They don't get that same kind of consideration. Um, everybody's treated equally, but they're not. Uh, at some point, you have to know who you're dealing with. So Shohei has earned the right, and we've, we've built a relationship. I need to know from him how he's feeling. Sam goes for Rendon, obviously on the IL with that wrist inflammation. Uh, what are your thoughts on that and how severe it might be? I don't know the severity. Uh, Gosh, he just gets going, and then he, then things happen again. Uh, he's another guy. I just, I'll just talk to him. I mean, as we get closer, and as the medical side signs off on it, then it becomes a conversation. In the meantime, it's just abiding by biology. What do I got to do here? And you do it, and you don't cry, and you don't complain. You just do it. And Anthony's been through some tough moments, but when he comes back, it's going to be a, a very high profile. Last health update, Taylor Ward, we saw him DHing last night, not in there again tonight. Frustrating was the word that he used to me earlier today. Obviously, a situation you guys want to monitor, yeah. but nice to get him some at-bats last night at the very least. Of course, he pinched it the night before that, and then he got his at-bats last night. I want to see him walking around right field. Um, that's the thing. I mean, when, when you have a guy like Shohei, who is your DH, and it, last year validates that. Uh, and Taylor is having as, as, as good of a year as anybody right now. But until he's ready to flip the ball back into a cutoff, man, uh, this is what we have to do. And he knows that. It's frustrating to him. Uh, and, and again, I guess there's, uh, there's a positive side of this where, you know, we're still hanging in there really well in spite of a lot of uh, baseball adversity. Uh, this group's going to come together at the right time. Uh, again, and I think a big part of it is one of our main strengths is how we are collectively.